everyone and welcome to my kitchen. Just like the title says, I found the only safe way to water bath cream of mushroom soup. I hope you stay tuned. Hi everybody and welcome back and welcome to my kitchen. Today we are going to work on water bath canning cream of mushroom soup the only safe way. Now you have to watch this full video. Make sure you watch the whole video up until the very end so you can see how you can safely water bath can cream of mushroom soup. Now let's talk a little bit about this, shall we? Do you know I had a video that was very controversial. It was about water bath canning cream of mushroom soup and how you should never water bath it. And then of course I've had quite a few people come to my channel to cause a little bit of a strife and stir up. As you know, the USDA says that you cannot water bath cream soups. The USDA says you can't water bath a lot of things. But today, I'm gonna to show you a safe and proven method that you can water bath cream and mushroom soup. But now you have to understand, you have to follow my technique exactly and you have to watch to the full end of the video. You cannot skip, you cannot only watch this first minute. You gotta watch to the total end of the video because there is where you'll find the amazing surprise. So let's get started. First thing I wanna share with you is, you have to have wide mouth jars. Yes, they have to be exactly wide mouth jars. You wanna get new ones like this, okay? So you wanna write that down. You want to have them that they have the screw band and the lid. I'm going to go ahead and make my cream of mushroom soup and then I'll get back to you and I'll show you how we're going to water bath can it. So you just stay tuned, okay? You want to make sure you have your really old water bath canner. Here, let me show you. So this is grandma's water bath canner. You want to have this, all right? Okay, so what we're going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to make the soup and then we're gonna put it in our jars. All right, so what we wanna do is we wanna take the lids off the jars, okay? Wash them real good, but you wanna make sure your jar is dry, totally dry, all right? That's really important. You don't wanna have the jar wet inside. So we're gonna take the lids off, just like this. We're gonna wash those jars really good. All right, we're gonna wash the jars and then I'm gonna dry them. Make sure, like I said, you don't want any water in your jars because that's real important. You'll understand here in just a moment. Now we're gonna go ahead, I'm gonna finish the soup, and then I'll show you what it looks like coming out of the canner. All right, I just got done putting the cream and mushroom soup in the jars. Now let me show you what it looks like. I'm gonna bring up my camera real close because you don't wanna miss this part. You all have to write it down and make sure you remember this. The only safe way to can cream of mushroom soup is this way. Let me show you. All right, let's take it out of the canner. Let me show you what it's like. Always make sure you put the lid this way so the steam doesn't hit you. And this is the only safe way to can cream of mushroom soup. Now you want to let it cool off and then you can put it on your shelf and it will last you for a long, long time. Canning cream of mushroom soup. This is the only safe way of doing it. Gotcha. If you're wondering what this video is all about, in case you're really confused by now, this is what they call a spoof video. This is a video of fun and just sharing with you a humorous way of looking at life's problems. As you know, I did that video and it was very controversial. In fact, I've had some people attack my channel because of it. Because I was following a very strict guideline on canning cream soups. And I wanted to make a spin-off on it. See, in life you can look at things two ways. You can look at it as discouragement, you can look at it as depressing, or you can look at it in a humorous way. And I decided to do that. So no, you are technically, you are not canning cream and mushroom soup. You're putting a can of soup 
into a jar to share with you this is the only way that you can have canned cream of mushroom soup. And the reason why I say that is simply because you do not want to ever can milk, flour, butter, and mushrooms into a thickening and then can it in the water bath canner. You see, what happens in life is people start out doing the things that were done many years ago. Back in the 1900s, people did water bath can green beans and potatoes and meat. That was their way of preserving food. They never canned cream soups. And that's what happens in our society is they do something and then they go more and more extreme. And to the point is there's no common sense. Canning cream of mushroom soup, there's no common sense to that. It's about as ridiculous as canning it in the jar like this. But because people have done it many years ago, does that mean that we still do it today? Maybe so, but mostly not. The food that we have today is different than the food that we had back then. The ground, the microisms, and the, all the bacteria and things like that are very different. If you're interested in knowing the real technical details why you don't want to water bath can low acid items, I want you to check out Red Rose Homestead, where she does a whole scientific method on the reasons why you don't want to can low acid foods in a water bath. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope it gave you something to laugh about. You know what? If more people laughed in the world, our problems would be so much easier. Take care, everyone, and we'll see you guys tomorrow. Hmm, now I gotta get some of my cream of mushroom soup. Just a minute. And by the way, commercial foods aren't always like the home cooked food. Commercial foods has a way of doing things that we cannot ever compete with in the home environment. Now, a lot of the foods, and most of the foods, we can can at home that's canned in the commercial. But I don't know about you, but I want to eat my food and know firsthand that it was safely preserved. Take care, everyone. <laughs> we'll see you guys tomorrow. And let me know if you want to can some of your cream of mushroom soup the way I did. You know, at least it's safe. Mm-mm. Mm-mm.